All right, so we're going to talk today about Keepa. It's one of my favorite extensions when sourcing it, and it's even great for when you're buying for your own personal life. Um, I'm always clear I'm getting the best deal. So let's talk about what all these dots and squiggles mean. So the red is the buy box, the pink, I mean. And that is, you know, the current buy box. So if you hover over it, it shows current buy box is 2630. Um, right now it's $25.92. And then third party FBA are the triangles here. So you can see the box and the triangle uh, buy box. Uh, FBA has been who FBA have been winning the buy box since December 1st. Before that, the buy box was merchant fulfilled. Um, all right, now then there's the if you want to see new third party, merchant fulfilled that's going to be these little boxes i go ahead and get rid of some of these because you don't need all that extra um, data uh, sales rank right here all right so you can see it's been a really good rank consistently and then used and new um, so when i look at this what i'm looking for is where the buy box has been consistently. Um, buy box has been anywhere between $12.98 and $25.99. So um, that's gonna help me inf help inform the kind of price point I would need to buy it for. Um, if I'm gonna turn it fast or slow. Another thing, okay, so you hover over statistics. This gives you the lowest um, price, the current price, the highest average, same with the rank. Um, and then it shows you the sales rank drops per month. So this shows 127 sales rank drops per month. What that can equate to is number of sales. Um, it has sold in a month, but again, to it's just another uh, data point that I use. So I check with Jungle Scout as well. But uh, these are good numbers to know. Um, what I do though is I take the average when I'm checking Jungle Scout, I take the average sales rank that, so the 51,000 rather than the current or the lowest. I, I want something that uh, takes into account oh, the overall in the last 90 days. Although one thing to keep track of, this listing, the the sales rank has stayed really quite this you know up and down but the same even when the price point was lower and higher people were still buying but if what you notice is that when the price goes high the rank goes high then that's something to keep in mind when you're making your purchases um, if you're trying to sell it for 50 bucks but the rank at 50 bucks is 250,000 whereas if the rank at 40 bucks is a hundred thousand you know it's going to sell a lot faster taking the price down to the forty dollars um all right so keep a now we're going to talk about the settings this setting right here it's uh display product stock quantity for some merchants on offer pages i have that clicked yes and then we'll come over here um, I know there's a paid extension that does the how many. We utilize this a lot um, because it's free. So it'll, sh it'll show you here. So see, only five left in stock, only one left in stock. Um, it won't do it for all of them, so it's not 100%, but it does give you some ideas. If you were going to sell this, you know, what you could sell it for and about how long until... Um, the price will hit your price point. Those are all good uh, things to note. And then, um, oh, this here is another graph. So used offers, new offers, the rating, review counts. So it just gives you more information. Oh, I know what I wanted to tell you, talk to you about was the range. So when you're looking at this, if you go to month, It'll give you a closer up view of what's happened in the last month with this price point. It gives you a pretty good idea what it'll do this next month. Then if you are looking at holiday items or something like that, you might want to see what it's doing. So say this was an Easter item 
And right around Easter, you want to know what kind of sales it's done over its uh, life, selling life. And uh, you can see, I mean, its price point um, has, <laughs> it had a pretty really l large dip here for a while, but then it's gone back up. The price point was really high back here. This is probably where more sellers found it and then started pulling the price down. The rank has stayed pretty consistent. It's just all information for you. Um, okay, so I'm any other, oh, keep it. Okay, so this is a pretty cool thing is find related deals. So you say you find a good product. This is just another way you can utilize a rabbit trail. You can come over here and they found you a deal. So this is usually $27.96. Currently it's $7.96. Um, this averages $110 is now $33.35. So that's just um, another way to increase your sourcing. All right, I think that is everything for this small Keepa video. Again, if you guys have questions, make sure to ask them in the group and uh, be on the lookout for when we release our training or if, depending on when you're seeing this, we might already have the training um, with the in-depth step-by-step how to source, 50, uh, sell 50K a month and work the four-hour work week. All right, thank you guys. Talk to you later.